Hello everybody and welcome back to Pokey Park Wii in the last episode. We um, went through the haunted house place thing and we got Miss Magius and we found Rotom. And in this episode we're going to go to the cavern thing, whatever this place is called. So let's call it to Skaroopy. I hope you guys like the background and stuff because that took a long time to upload. I had to, to, I had to um, upload it three different times. Because it, it wouldn't process. I don't know why. It just, it would upload fine. It just didn't, like, process. So I had to redo everything three times. So I finally got to upload it today, so that's a good thing. Um, so, actually pretty close to the end of the game. Like, considering, not counting that we're going to have to go back and backtrack to get lots of friends. Um, but... We're almost done with the game, guys. I mean, look, here. Um, let's see, can I show you guys? Yeah, look at all the- look, we only need three more prison pieces, and then we're done with the prison pieces. So... How many berries do I have? Wait, 1,500. Nah, I don't need to. Oh, yes, I do. And my TV is glitching out. What the fuck? My TV better not do this. Because I've had two fair recordings of this because of that. So. Um, who are we gonna need? How much do you want? That's like all of our berries. Who has like 1,000? Yeah, let's just get up our, our HP. Oh, that's good. We're holding a rock. Oh, man. Yay, I've gotten fatter, apparently. So let's go this way, and hopefully that stupid thing with my TV doesn't happen again. I don't know why, but my PVR does that sometimes, like, when... I'm recording and, or something, like, if I have my computer plugged in and, like, the PVR plugged in to the computer, it'll start glitching like crazy and it's just stupid, so. Um, maybe I should do something quick. Hold on a second. Okay, hopefully I can, hopefully it doesn't do this again. Alright, so let's go over here and, um, I'll talk to Lil' Punny. Hi, Lil' Punny. Lovely. I know. Don't know why I didn't read that, but oh well. So let's play chase. Let's let's play some chase. Oh man, it's bouncing. Oh man. Run. That was so difficult. Oh man, it has big ears. Oh man. You're cool, and now we're friends. I'll give you all the help I can with attractions, so be sure to call me. Okay. So call her, maybe. Hey, I just met her. And it's crazy. But I'm not gonna sing this. So, I'll shut up, maybe. There's a Charizard up there. Oh man, I'm gonna talk to him. He's overrated. Pokemon thing. Man, I don't know where my water bottle is. Welcome, Pikachu. I've heard so much about you. Now I must tell you this. Only those who are worthy, worthy of reaching the Sky Pavilion, can trust past... Uh, can travel past the granite zone. Oh, it's the granite zone, my bad. The ruins here will test you just as the ancient promised. Yeah, I don't know. By the way, why did the why did the ground shake a while ago? It makes me feel uneasy. I don't know why you're asking me, I'm a Pikachu. Oh man, there's a dude over here. Absol is one, actually one of my favorites. From Gen 3, that is. He's actually also one of my top Pokemon. I really like him. This attraction has a long history. We'll continue to guard the ruin. It doesn't matter whether the ground shakes or the sky falls. Absol. I'll have to ask for it for the berries and the, 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 yeah. Absol. Let's begin come this way. Okay. So here's another running type game. You have to shake your wing up and down hit two to jump over the hurdles and yeah, it's a not lose. Um you know, let's be a little punny, just because we just became friends with little punny and stuff. This is another vibrating game thing. So let's aim for the bonus! Let's go! Let's do this thing! Yeah! Two. Yeah, 
is actually pretty difficult if you can't multitask, I guess. If you can't, like, hit two buttons at the same time. <laughs> or do two different things, like, shake the remote and press the two button. But, I guess the better the Pokemon at the game, the easier it is. So yeah, we get berries. 300, see, look at that. That's like way too much berries. They're too generous in this game. Like, what the heck? Now, I think you guys have noticed how um, fast this series has been going. Well, that's pretty much because I've been like clearing each zone in like an episode. The only like, only zone I haven't cleared two episodes in like an episode is like the first zone, the beach zone, and the ice zone. I think. That's all. Which is pretty much all the zone. But like. They, you cleared them in like two or three at the most, so it's pretty, pretty, uh, pretty fast game and stuff. So, but if you're trying to, um, like get, I'm not gonna hit this. No. So if you're trying to like get all the friends, it, it can be a little longer than, uh, you know, it would if we weren't. Weren't. So yeah. All of us in the Granite Zone have been keeping an ancient promise. To guard the Sky Pavilion. Are you challenging me to a skill game? Yet, yeah, why yes, I'll battle you. Okay. Time to show me what you've got. Charizard is actually a pretty good uh, battler, along with like Blastoise and stuff, which I'll get to them later. And I just ran into that. And yeah. Stop running. Ah. No. I think he's using Fire Blast, which is also pretty, uh... And I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I'm running away. Two more hits will kill me, but, like, one more hit will kill him. So... Or, two more. Ah! A yeah! A tackle killed a Charizard. Yay, Pikachu. Alright. You're a tough one. Call me and and uh and I will help you with attractions as the best as I can. So call him maybe. Okay. Baltoy! We're friends with you. Hopip, you suck. Only those who have cleared Absol's attraction can go through. Why? Well it's part of the promise we've kept since ancient times. Okay, now you, that you have cleared the attraction, you may go. Thank you for honoring our ancient promise. I feel we should become friends. By this... This, by the way, is not part of our ancient promise. I just like you. Ooh, he likes me! Yeah. Sorry, Baneeri likes me better. Get it? It's from the anime. Ha ha ha. That was not a good anime. I like the first one better. Just saying. An old man flooring is changing. What the heck? Didn't know you could do that. So I'm gonna run across here. And I actually get lost in here too. Um, I probably won't now that I've actually played it when I know the game, I guess. But when I was first playing the game, I got lost in stuff. Flygon! You must have come a long way. I'm sure you've noticed this huge gate. It is the promise gate, and your goal, the Sky Pavilion, is beyond it. I only let those who persist with persistence, wisdom, and courage pass through. If you wish to carry on, you must collect the three secret words. Yeah, that's the thing about that. I don't like the three secret words. Oh, I'm gonna talk to this sign, because I'm not crazy. Because talking to signs makes Pokemon appear. Oh, man. That's just if I'm... I want to go somewhere. I'll probably use those once um, I beat the game and we just have to get friends. That's probably what I'm gonna do. And I've been actually thinking about this too. I think I'm not gonna show everyone. I'm just gonna show the final um, Pokemon in each attraction. So I'll show you what I mean when I get to that point. I'm the one of the protectors of the Granite Zone. If you wish to pass this point, you must defeat me in battle. Prepare yourself. Okay. Blastoise is actually pretty good. I had trouble with him when I first played the game. Because of how, um, you know, um, small the area is get what I'm saying, but, um, I think he's easy enough, because I just beat him without getting hit, so, yeah, and I'm thirsty, but my water bottle is like the other side of the room, I underestimated you, you were magnificent, you may, pr you may proceed, I admit that there, that, 
I'm not strong enough to protect the granite zone. I must retra retrain myself ha somehow. Goodbye. Bye bye. Blastoise, you're actually one. You're my second favorite of the of the third and first and third gen starters. Um, third as in Fire Edley Crane. I like Venusaur then Blastoise then. You know. Okay. So I think I have to go back actually and hit that thing again. So I'm gonna go back and hit that thing again. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. At least. Yeah, I should have done that the first start. I forget. Um, but yeah, I don't know why. I've just had the. Ever since I played um, played my first Pokemon games, I just liked Grass types. Um, Bulbasaur was the first starter I had, and I'm not. And um, that just Bulbasaur just helped had me like at liking Grass types, I guess. Um, so pretty much every game I you every game I got, I started out with the grass type. So, and then after I beat the game or something, recently I've been playing with other types like um, uh, like Oshawa. I really like Oshawa in the in a uh, black and white. I like Snivy a lot, but Snivy isn't all that good. So, Oshawa is probably one my favorite of the three, and Trico is my favorite actually. So. There's your fact of the day, Treat, because my favorite starter. Probably. There we go, I did it. That's pretty difficult to do. I don't know why, I can never do it correctly. Hey, Skaroopy, we talked to you outside the thing. When you go up the slope and across the stones, there's a switch that opens the secret door, so they say. I've tried to get there myself, but the stones be begin to move as, the as you cross them, so move quickly. Oh man, platforming. But platforming in Pokemon, what is this madness? And I jumped off a cliff! That was awesome. Actually, <laughs> haven't done that before. So, yeah, that happened. Maybe I should be slouching the way I am. Okay. So I'm gonna go up here. Whee! Do 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 do. And oh man! Oh, thing. I think Ah oh, Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna meet you back when I make it. So be right back. Okay, I did it. Hit a button. Hope I can finish this freaking episode in time because my battery is kinda low on the computer. An old man is door. Oh my god. It's a freaking door, man. It's a freaking door. Would you look at that? We Ah! Oh, skydiving! Okay. So we just made that fire over here go away. So I'm gonna go over here. And oh man, nothing happened. But it did. So, yeah, I'm gonna go down here. Oh no, it's a Porygon! Z, I think? Is that Porygon Z? Yep! How did you find this room? I come here sometimes. I remind, I remind myself how lonely you can feel, and how lucky I am to have friends. Sometimes you need to be alone. Hmm, I wonder if, if you were even listening to me. You're looking for secret words. Here, if you answer my questions correctly, I'll tell you one. Let's have a quiz. Fine. Yeah. What are we waiting for? Right, time for the first question. What's my name? You're obviously Porygon7. It's just Porygon7. Exactly right, told you. It's Porygon7. Okay, on to the next question. What uh, was Snorlax doing the first time you met him? He was obviously crying. He was crying. He was crying. Told you he was crying. Exactly right. And now for the, your final question. Who had a fight with Feralgator in the beach zone? It was Why Not. Come on, guys. We all knew it was Why Not. Exactly right. See, I told you. I was right on that one. You know how much um, I'll give you this secret word. The word is love. To love is to care. Now we shall be friends. Oh, how cheesy. Yay. Happiness. Okay. Now we got that person as a friend. And I can bet you a lot that this is not going to be a 30 minute episode because of my computer being um, almost dead. And um, this is actually a pretty long um, place world thing. 
and I went the wrong way. So I'm gonna go back down there and go over here and go over here. Whee! Hooray! Cause we have to go up there to see that clay doll or whatever. Or is that a clay doll? No, it's a bronze doll. The builders of the ruins had had a way of speaking with us heart to heart. In the same way, the Sky Pavilion was built with our help. Cont continue onward if you wish to learn more. S s I don't know. Hold it, not so fast. Do you do you know at least one of the secret words? That's right. Secret word are secret words are the words of love. And that's strange because well, never mind. Let's be friends. Now climb the pyramid and find the secret. Second secret word. What's your secret, Bronzor? Huh? Huh? Electrifier! You! Are you the one they call Lightning Strike in the Lava Zone? Don't you think the name would suit me better? Who's who's better qualified to, to be called Lightning Strike anyway? This can be decided by battle. Defeat me, and I'll accept you as the true owner of the name Lightning Strike. I'll also let you pass by, of course. Wow, all for a name? Really, dude? Really? Are you really that stubborn or something? I'm gonna go this way. This way now. That hurt my face. I'm gonna hit you with my butt. Cause I can. Cause I can. I'm gonna hit you with my butt again. Yeah. Cause hitting you with my butt is like the best thing ever. What an incredible surprise. I never guessed the Poke Park had a Pokemon as tough as you. You move like lightning. Your skills are super sharp. Now I'll, I must leave this place. I must return. I must retrain and return stronger. We must battle if we meet again. Okay. But we won't, so it doesn't matter. I mean, what? Who said that? I'm gonna go up here now. And I accidentally hit that button. Because, you know, I didn't mean to. Oh, man, fire! You go. Pfft. Fire, you go. Pfft. Because that's what fire does. It doesn't just go out. It just go. Pfft. Yeah. Tricky platforming skill, by the way. Oh, it's check this thing. Yes, I want to ride the rope car. Who doesn't run, want to ride the rope car? Oh, it's over. Oh, it's a Toki kiss. Hello. I love its cry. In the game. It's so awesome. Tihi, nice job getting here. Are you trying to keep, uh, reach the Sky Pavilion for everyone's sake? Or just for your own? Tell tell you what? Su succeed in my ob obstacle hop and I'll tell you my secret word. Will you try my obstacle hop? Yes, I will. Whoa! Let's get started. This is actually kind of tricky. So, I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> Yeah. 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 You have to do a lot of, um, when, uh, eh, yeah. Yeah. Of, like, you know, changing your perspective, I guess. Yeah. But they give you, again, way too much time. This game is pretty easy with this kind of stuff. And what if you fell? Like, would you just die or something? Like, seriously. Your reasons for reaching the Sky Pavilion are unselfish, right? Congratulations. Here is my secret word. Just as I promised, the word is peace. Will you be my peace-loving friend? The last secret word lies with Snorlax in the cavern zone. You learned a secret word. The word is peace. Huzzah. Alright, guys. Let's go on here. That was fun. That was so much fun. Alright, um, as you heard by Toki Kiss, we have to go back to the cavern zone. Um, and that seems, sounds like a good idea for me to call it here as an episode, because I think I need a decently shorter episode now, and my computer is kinda no, no. low on battery, if you know what I mean. So, I am... In the next episode, we are going to go to the Cavern Zone, pop Snorlax, and get the last piece, uh, or last, you know, secret word, and then we're going to talk to Flygon, and then see what happens then. And then we're going to, yeah, do stuff. 
So, um, I'm Robodeki Assassin 3, this has been Poke Park Wii, and that's Pikachu, and that's a Bronzor, and that's a Pokemon in front of me, where'd you go, I don't know. But, um, so yeah, this is part 13, and let's hope I have better luck in uploading. Um, so, I'm Robodeki Assassin 3 again, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, and to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and on Twitch TV, and I'll see you guys in the next episode, have a good day.